Hello geocachers, it's Symbol here and uh, this is um, the third uh, cache in the series at uh, my local um, park called Brinton's Park and I really love this because this um, is actually a sensory garden it's not so colourful now because it's uh, winter time and it's raining I thought uh, this would be the best time for you to see this uh, clever little um, cache uh, in uh, the summer a lot of people come here and uh, there's a huge park back that way and this is the sentry garden but we're coming closer to the cache and around about here we get a beep which you can see this is um, all. This all smells beautiful in the summer, uh, and it beeps about now. And this is actually uh, it's a microcache. It's a magnetic microcache, and this is a perfect place to find it in the summer when there's so many people walking around these paths and around the the gardens. You can actually sit here and I don't think there's anybody around in this rain. This is why I've done it today while it's raining, less people uh, walking around. And you can sit down and look, look at that. I'm going to sit down now, or we'll pretend to sit down because it's soaking wet. And then there's actually somebody over there actually look, looking so. Actually, I'll just show you the. The, ge the geocache is just under here. I've got it there. It's, it's there somewhere, but I can't get it now. I hope it's still there. Uh, hold on. The trouble is, there's a person in the window I can see there. If we kneel down, let's go and see if we can find it. There it is. It's there. Got it. Got it everyone. Look. It was in, look it's black. It's a tiny little micro cache that just goes in underneath here. So you can just sit down and then fiddle. Fiddle with your fingers just underneath where you sat there, look. So you can imagine you're sat here enjoying the sensory garden and then your hand goes underneath and nobody will know. That's the person in that one in that window there, look, can you see it to the left? Anyway, I don't think you see what I... He probably actually knows because you get permission, you have to get permission from these parks to uh, put uh, geocaches down. But I hope you enjoyed that. I think that's really clever. Just give you an idea that you can still put uh, in public areas, uh, just put it on a, a bench like that. And you sit down, admire the sensory garden, and then your hand goes to towards the is it to the left underneath and you can get that micro cache quite easily without uh, being spotted by uh, muggles walking doggles which there are a lot in this park hope you enjoyed that this is symbol and happy geocaching everyone and there's a biker there look see there's still people in the park okay bye <laughs>